Virginia. West Virginia is known for hillbillies. A lot of baloney. They call it West Virginia steak. And hot dogs. Let's go check it out. I absolutely love going to West Virginia. I graduated from high school in West Virginia and uh, then I went to Marsh University. stop on the West Virginia Turnpike. You got a drink? Monster. Man, it is a beautiful day. It's in the 80s. It is really nice.
West Virginia doll. Okay, perfect. And chili cheese fries. Gotcha. And then can I get a Corona as well? Yeah, of course you want extra light. Extra. Extra, gotcha. And I want the Thundering Herd dog. Okay. And did you get the West Virginia? I want the Hillbilly dog. And the Hillbilly, perfect. And crinkle cut fries. Gotcha. And a Diet Coke. And a Diet Coke. Is that everything for you? That's it. Perfect. We got those drinks. Inside, outside, taking it to go? Inside. Inside. All right. It's going to be twenty six sixty on card. Perfect. I don't know what I got to do for that take-up job. Over here, let's look over here. Let's see what we got. I don't see anything. Up here. I don't see anything back here. Do you see anything in there? So we're waiting on two Oh, are you? Oh, wow, everybody's waiting. <clears throat> well, we can get it and go if you want. No. <laughs> we're just waiting. Okay. <clears throat> we'll just wait. <clears throat> Yeah. What are you doing? I put books on your shit all over the place. I like to say this. This is an experience, isn't it? It absolutely is. I mean, it's like no other place I've ever eaten. We've been here once, many years ago, but it's uh, great to be back, and it's definitely an experience. That's for sure. And how long did we wait in line? It's probably two hours. Two hours. Two hours. So I got the hillbilly dog, which basically is just uh, a deep fried wiener with mustard, onion, and chili. And Tina got what'd you get? Honey? I got the West Virginia dog, and it has mustard, onion, chili, and coleslaw. And coleslaw. Okay. <laughs> and then, and then, uh, tell us what this is. Those are my chili cheese fries. I saw someone when we were in waiting in line forever order those and they came out and I was like, I've got to have them. There's, I've just got to have them. <laughs> and then the last one I had was this one right here. That's the uh, Thundering Herd since I went to Marshall. That's what we're going to have. It's got everything on it, but it's got jalapenos and slaw and I can't wait to try all this. I'm starving. Yes, <laughs> me too. It's been a long day. Yeah.
when you go. How is it? It is so good. Really good hot dog. But it is even better because I am starving. <laughs> Really yeah, it's uh the deep fried wieners make it a little bit different, but it adds actually pretty good taste. They're not they're not overly crunchy or anything like that, so it's really good. Chili cheese fries, yum. Chili cheese fries, yum. Chili cheese fries, yum. So the thundering herd hot dog. It's kicking, just like the Thunder and Herd did to Notre Dame. Kicked the rear end, this is kicking my rear end, is hot. Mm. Mm. That's good. So, Hillbilly Hot Dogs is definitely an iconic place in West Virginia. It's only been around for 12 years, but it is popular. As you can see, two hours waiting in line to get hot dogs. The place is crazy, mm -hmm. but it brought to mind of some other iconic places or people, and the first iconic person I, that I can think of is Jerry West, who I think is one of the greatest basketball players ever from West Virginia. Or Randy Moss, one of the greatest football players in my opinion. Yes, and he's um, from West Virginia. Yep. Yep. Rand University, but actually went to Marshall <laughs> University. And we got to see him play a lot. Yeah. And then I think of other places. Of course, there is Nick Saban, who's from Fairmont, West Virginia, and now the coach of Alabama. Uh, but then I think of other places, like food places, like uh, Gino's Pizza. Or Tudor's Biscuit World. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And then, you know, there's some iconic figures, like the Sutton Bigfoot. The uh, Mothman, Point Pleasant, West Virginia. Yeah, and there was the Point Pleasant Festival today, which probably <laughs> contributed to this line. Yeah, we had no idea that was going on. Actually. And then also the uh, Flatwoods Monster. So today's been an awesome, awesome day to come up here, yeah. drive up to West Virginia, eat at Hillbilly Hot Dogs. Yeah, beautiful day, great hot dogs, great atmosphere. Mm -hmm. And if you ever have the chance, you gotta find your way to Hillbilly Hot Dog. <laughs> Tina had some final thoughts. I just was wondering if any of you watching, have you ever been here to Hillbilly Hot Dogs? Yeah, let us know and yeah. tell us what you thought. And I guess if you haven't been, Will would you, you come? come? Yeah. Would you wait in two hours for a hot dog? I would. It's so cool. And it's yeah. so good. It's worth the experience for sure. We've done it twice and I would do it again. Yeah. Been a good day. <laughs>